we can get the column letter in Excel starting with the column function. Type equals the word column with open and closing parentheses, and we are given the column number of the current cell, since no arguments were given. The column number is one of the arguments required in the address function. We can nest the response from the column function directly in the address function to give us the column letter, though the address function returns other text with it. Type equals address open parenthesis. The first argument is row number. I'll simply put a 1 for this, as we're concerned about the column letter, not the row number. I'll type an empty call to the column function for the column number argument. Let's see what we get. Contained in this response is the column letter, but it comes with extra numbers and dollar signs. The dollar signs in the response tell us that this is an absolute reference to the address that was returned by our call to the nested address formula. We can get rid of the dollar signs by making the response relative. This can be done by adjusting the input for the abs underscore num argument for the address function. The number 4 will make both row and column relative, thus getting rid of the dollar signs. Finally, we can get rid of the row reference by using the substitute function. The substitute function is essentially a find and replace function. Since we simply call the number 1 as our row reference, we can find that 1 and replace it with an empty string denoted by double quotes. We've removed the 1 from our nested address formula's response. Now we have our complete column letter formula. If we drag our formula over, we get a new column letter for each new column. This tutorial was designed to teach how to build a nested formula that returns the column letter of the cell where the formula is executed. This function can be saved as a named formula and used in other, more complex formulas that require the knowledge of the column letter. The file I used to make this video is available on our website at stproductions.com. Simply follow the link in the description. This was designed to be a short and superficial quick tip. If the lack of detail in this video leaves you wanting, see our expanded video on the subject. Or, if you have specific questions, please let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.